Good morning, guys. Hope you're doing awesome. Hope the beta test is going well. And uh, you might be noticing that I'm kind of uh, not wearing any shirt and standing outside in the freezing cold. And there's a reason for that. And I just want to use this as a reminder to encourage you to spend a little bit of time with a slight shiver. So right now, I don't know if you can see me, but I've got very slight goosebumps. And that's kind of the, the state where you want to get to. You don't want to get to the point where you're absolutely freezing and you're going to get frostbite. But you want to get to a point, um, at least several minutes a day, where you are, your body is um, in a state of slight cold. In a, slight, uh, in a state where it needs to start generating its own heat. And as a result, ends up burning more calories. There's a lot of research that shows the benefits of cold thermogenesis, as it's known. So I spend about 5 to 10 minutes outdoors like this, uh, usually most days. Uh, at least in the winter time. And if you don't want to do this, then don't worry. Uh, you can always take a cold shower. You can put some ice packs um, that are obviously covered. Put them on your upper back. This is where you have a lot of brown adipose tissue, which has been shown to be very metabolically active. It actually has higher amounts of mitochondria and blood vessels. And research has shown that activating your brown adipose tissue actually helps you burn your white adipose tissue, which is this you know, stuff down here that a lot of us want to get rid of. So spending more time in the cold is a very, very beneficial thing, not only for fat loss, but also for your health. A lot of people think that, oh, you're going to get cold, you're going to get sick if you go outside like this. Well, the reality is that most people get sick in the cold because their immune system is depleted in the first place. And cold therapy has been shown to actually be a very powerful way at boosting your immune power and making your body what's what a lot of scientists call body hardy so it becomes more hardy to a lot of kind of harsh environmental conditions so anyways uh, i just want to shoot a quick little video to encourage you to spend a little bit of time getting cold it could be reducing the temperature in your thermostat taking a cold shower or a hot cold contrast shower um, or doing things just to kind of get in a state of a slight shiver because when you do that you raise your metabolic rate so your body starts to generate heat and uh, there we go so a little tip for today and i hope you are doing great have uh, have an amazing weekend and keep up the awesome work